gimbal guy here and you're looking at the Horizon Hobby Blade 200QX. For those of you who are not familiar with this quad, this is the most powerful quad offered in the 200mm scale size. Brushless motors. The 200QX is powered by the 800mAh 20C battery. Plastic composite blades. The body is also comprised of plastic. The main rotor diameter is 4.45 inches, 113 millimeters. With the landing gear, it stands at about 4.5 inches off the ground. Now, the 200QX only comes in a bind and fly package. I'm running my DX5E transmitter. It's by Spectrum. It's a full range 2.4 gigahertz mode 2 5 channel transmitter. You can actually download some software that enables the 200QX to fly inverted. With the update firmware, you get three different modes. Stability bailout is new. 3D studility, which enables the inverted flight. And then I believe there's 3D agility. Now with this software update, there are a few things that are required. A set of sports props. They also require a battery upgrade, which is the same 800 milliamp battery, but it's a 30C battery. It'll discharge faster, but it should in turn give you more punch, which I think is needed in the inverted flight. Now that was just a quick overall rundown of the 200QX by Blade. What I'm going to do is take out the internals and put them in an aftermarket frame kit. Aluminum post and carbon fiber frame with foldable arms. This should increase stability, durability, and overall performance. As you can see, I've disassembled the 200QX. I do have everything exposed, the board, and I have disconnected all motors. Now I'm ready for the transfer. I have also constructed the bottom half of the carbon fiber frame. All that's left to do is to put the internals from the 200QX into the frame, button it up, and I'm ready to go. As you see here, we have all of the internals into the bottom half of the frame that I've built. I'm going to add the motors and then connect them and add the top of the frame and we should be done. As you all can see now, I'm totally finished with the build. I've transferred all the internals to the aftermarket frame. And now the 200QX is nothing but a shell. The aftermarket frame is a CNC Micro Heli carbon fiber frame.